What can, what should you do if you encounter a person with a gun ready to open fire? Michelle talks to some experienced hands to better understand your options for confronting a potential shooter. We are in an open carry state, so people are allowed to open carry their firearms, but that doesn't mean in their hands. It's becoming more prevalent. Gunmen opening fire on crowds of unsuspecting victims. In El Paso, the gunman carrying his weapon through the parking lot decked out in protective ear and eye gear. That's not something that a reasonable person would see or uh, a reasonable person would look at and expect to be normal. Many people wonder what they should do if they see something like this. Chris Place, the owner of The Weapons Place in West Monroe, says every situation is different, but you need to assess that situation before you engage. Before somebody would take any kind of deadly action against somebody like that, they, they really have to have a reason to believe that violence is about to happen. Place says you should say something if you see something. If they were to say, go ahead and start giving verbal commands, uh, you know, alerting anybody they could see around them that was a, a police officer, security guard, something like that. Um, that would be my recommendation at this point. Another thing that could save lives is something police calls skipping the denial. React like it's real and then hope for the best that not. Louisiana, Arkansas, and Mississippi are all open carry states, but there are laws for how you carry. Your gun must be holstered. Once it's taken out of a holster or put into the hands to be displayed basically by the public, then it's committing an actual crime. Reporting in West Monroe, Michelle Martin, NBC 10, your local news leader. Again, every situation is different, and Chris says that action beats reaction every time. It's important, he says, to stay aware of your surroundings.